25. What does it take to be a good comedian? Fox 43's Chris Garrett has a look at the science of comedy. You ever wake up one morning and wonder to yourself, I want to try something new, something different, something out of my comfort zone. So for 2018, I did. Comedy. Here goes nothing. It's an art that many have tried to master. Names like Pryor, Murphy, Carlin, Chappelle, Whoopi, Amy Schumer, just to mind. But to give a primer in stand-up, I was lucky to find a local comedian that has earned renown and many folks laughing every single day on stage and on the radio, Earl David Reed. And before I knew it, I was on Cameron Street. <laughs> Boo! What the? Earl David Reed, what are you doing here? What am I doing here? I heard you wanted to do comedy, so I stopped by to check it out. What are you doing? All right, come on. It wasn't really that bad, right? No, it wasn't that bad at all. Hey, you ever think about wearing a mask while you're on stage? Seriously? I'm just messing with you. Listen, oh. there's a couple things you have to remember. First right. of all, a lot of comedians go on stage, they bring a drink with them and everything right. else like that. Right. I don't care whether you're up there eight minutes or an hour. Uh -huh. You don't need a drink. Oh. You can't go an hour or at least eight minutes without drinking anything, so that's out. Okay. You can take that out. out. Secondly, okay. most importantly, when you get up there, no matter how confident you are, mm -hmm. how well you know your stuff, someone may try to throw you and yell something at you and make you feel like really bad or even try to heckle you, as they would call it. Right. So let's see how that works. Let me go. Ahead. Okay, let me go. go for it. Go for it. You suck. You're the worst thing I've ever seen. I can't believe your mama even let you out the house to tell jokes. Okay, that's a little brutal. I mean, my mom is my, my, my friend. Uh, look, I'm so, look, I'm sorry, man. Come on, man. I'm sorry, man. I didn't know you were so sensitive. The coach, Earl David Reed, is a trendsetter in comedy and radio around the world. With 15 years of stand-up comedy on his resume, Earl has performed at over 100 comedy clubs and colleges, performed in Las Vegas and Atlantic City. So his words carry weight. There are three things you have to remember to do in comedy. One, make sure you're prepared. Know what you're going to do when you get up there. B, when you get up there, be relaxed. Look like you're having a great time. And three, the most important of all, make sure you're funny. If you're really funny, the other two don't even matter. Just make sure you're really funny. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put together a little act for you together. I'm gonna let you come on my show. I'm performing live at the Eichelberger Performance Art Center in Hanover on January 27th. We're gonna tell your friends to go to theike.org, get tickets, and come see you live perform. And it's gonna be that easy. You, me, in front of a large audience performing comedy for the first time. What? Wait, me on stage doing stand-up? Maybe, but I have one more question for Mr. Reed. Do I have to drop some bombs, you know, cuss words to make people laugh? Oh, you mean like But do I really need to say those words to make people laugh? Nah, nah. But sometimes when they don't laugh, you're up there thinking So give me some tips on stage presence. You I mean, I'm a DJ, but it has to be different when it comes to being a comedian, correct? Eh, it's a little bit different. Not that much. Follow me, I'll show you. All right, all right. So tell me about this whole stage presence stuff. Well, first of all, you have to be comfortable on the stage. You gotta know where your audience is, you gotta check them out, you gotta know who's sitting where, you gotta be able to pick out the people that you know and that are gonna be the happier faces that you can focus on. But the best thing is mic technique. Always know where the microphone is. Always be able to take it off the stand and make sure that, oh, jeez. What did you do that for? I can't believe that happened. So, do you wanna continue this whole microphone technique? <laughs> I think the lesson's over for today. Chris Garrett, Fox 43. And you can find out for yourself if his training paid off. Chris will join Earl David Reed on stage for his comedy tour at the Eichelberger Performing Arts Center in Hanover, January 27th. We have a link and ticket information on our website, fox43.com.